up there? What are you wondering? Have you got any spare time for me? What's wrong with it? Since when does a seed fall from the sky like a meteorite, land and not get damaged? this then? Lovely nom nom! Hi, hi. Thanks! What did you do? I sprayed Fanta on it. Might sting for a while. I, I should have said sorry. So what is it then? It's a species called Zorango. They're considered cannibals of their world. They feed off plant life. The only problem is their planet doesn't really provide a full meal. So some go off in search of other planets to feast upon the plant life. Trouble with that though, plants don't really last long in space and the Zorango aren't exactly smart. So how do they survive? Well, their mother would be this sort of shell thing. She would float in the shell till she finds a planet that would be best suited for her child, then she'll drop it off on that planet. Of course, the mother dies during that, but Zorango are really born survivors. The baby will wake up and instantly think, food! It doesn't need its mum, or anyone as that matter of fact, to help it. How long will it take for this Zorango to mature? Judging from its size, I'd say he's going through his teenage years. That explains its stroppiness, then. <laughs> Come on, let's stop this thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. How are we meant to stop it? Simple. Herbicide dye. Rimadine B. Maybe a bit of echinite liquid gas added in with it. And water mixed together. When it smells the water, it will act as the bait. Water is a bit like chocolate to them. They love it, but this water is poisoned with all these little nasties, which if we wait for a few moments after spraying it, it will dissolve into little specks of... specks. Well, it would, but I'm going to add some Raikai juice to it as well. The specks will turn back into a seed, long and complicated explanation why, lots of fish and lizards and miniature sponges. Hi. Herbicide dye, Ewok gas, and Rika juice. Anything else? Mm, don't think so. Come on, we need to get a move on. After all, who are you gonna call? Plants! Busters! No? Not funny? Let's get gardening! Gotta spray them all!
How can you have all these things but not have some hair straighteners? Well, I'm not the type to have hair straighteners. Well, I didn't think you were the type to run around in a pink dress either. The monster escaped! Okay, whose bright idea was it to run away from it then? Well, mine, but... Anyway, go find it. I'll be with you quicker than... Rather quick. See it anywhere? There! Ah, he's already started. Hey, Mr. Z! You smell! Ah, time for you to save the world. There we go! Aw, did I miss all the fun? Ah, uh, see? You were brilliant! You saved the world from dying and a whole species from dying. That's got to be... Well, it's alive, you know. I call her Sky. Lovely name, although I consider calling her Shirley for a while too. Bow wow. My god, why did you change it? Well, sorry. I had a slight problem when I regenerated. Can't blame you. You're a man. Yes, well, the Barktis. Bones and relative canine dimensions in space. Bit old. It's capable of travelling through time and... Yes, haven't we heard this bit before? <laughs> <laughs> you know, Dora, you can travel with us if you want. Really? Yeah, I don't mind. No. My time traveling days are over. Well, in here I suppose. You do have potential though. Potential for what? Remember unit? Ah oh, no, no. That bunch of loonies? I'd never join them. Not in a million years. Oh well, let's take it to the year one million two thousand eleven then. Goodbye, Doctor. Goodbye, Dora. See you later, Amy later. In a while, Dora Dial. Oh, she was cool. Now, see? If you put those bad feelings aside, you two can become good mates. 
You should do that more often. What do you mean more often? Nothing. I... Come on, let's get rid of this seed. Why did you start on your own? 